YouTubers, Electric Adventures here, having a look at another one of the t titles on the original Spectre video. Um, and this one is called Telly Bunny. I do remember playing this one back in the day. Don't have a real copy. Um, haven't played it for ages as well. So we'll see how we go. It's, bit, it's another maze type game. So let's give it a go. We're going to play pack just to start with. So, we need to get all the hearts. Once again, full on music. Hold my button down and turn green. So it does have a picture of the um can I, Okay. The turtle blocks me. If you think I don't know what I'm doing, you'd be very correct. Oh. It's interesting, it actually auto corners for you, so you don't have to hit the um, corners exactly like that. I'm not sure what holding the button down does for you. Oh, now I remember. You have to get the turtle to eat the um. Right, so you've got to turn the things green and you've got to get the turtle to eat them. Right. Now I remember. Let's see if we can do that. Okay. Going in the right direction. Yes, there we go. See, so the turtle ate one of the green things. So when you press your button, you're going to reverse the direction the turtle goes in, or change the direction. And that's what the, arrow, the white arrow on the left is. That's it. Now we're getting somewhere. My god, this, this makes the game a bit more complicated, doesn't it? That's okay, he'll get there in a minute. Oh! Right, the snake changes the direction of Turtle 2. But he made it there in the end, right. Now I've got to get the turtle out of that almost like infinite loop he's stuck in.
That's it. Oh no, he's going the wrong way. That's it. Now. Oh god. Ah. It's not easy. <laughs> Definitely a challenge. But it's also not like other games. Alright, so it actually kept our progress. Right, so you don't actually have to... I'll miss the turn. You bugger of a snake. At least you get plenty of lives. Okay, that's probably easier to get to the turtle there. I just had a thought. I actually think that like, you don't actually have to be next to the turtle change the direction. I reckon if you hold the button down and press in the direction, it will change the turtle. Let's let's try that. So this is practice. So let's have another go. I'm determined to finish a level. I'm right. You don't actually have to be near the turtle. This makes it interesting. Okay, we're on target. Oh, maybe the carrots for me. Oh, I haven't turned it into a... And we've made it. It's very, you've got to watch in two different places at once. It's actually um, quite.
quite challenging. So, the maze doesn't change, but you get a different fruit. So I don't know what happens when they hit a broken heart. That kills a turtle. There you go. Oh god, it's hard watching. So I didn't get the bonus fruit that time. You don't have to get the bonus to finish the level. Oh, I was pushing it a little bit there. So, this is actually quite an enjoyable game. It's got a lot more to it than some of the other games. There's a definite bit of challenge here. You know, even the things such as the easy corner to easy corner turnering are actually a very nice feature. Oops, oh. I'm just not sure where your lives are, but Oh, on the right there. Yeah, okay. I've got three bunnies left still. Now, as long as the snake doesn't get me. And obviously, if you're trying to get the fruit, you spell out the letters, what each of the letters of fruit. So you've got an ongoing challenge there. Okay, so the purple broken hearts do actually disappear. Got a 
accident confused, yay. Whoop. Oh, I was looking at the turtle. <laughs> oh dear. I'm sure this would have kept me very busy back in the day. I can remember playing it. It has a few levels as far as oh, well, different coloured maze, and it is um, changing it up with a few things. It's not necessarily getting that much harder. second fruit piece. sides of the game board that can be quite challenging. Hiding in one of these can confuse the snake for a little bit. Hmm. The very fact that I'm continuing to play and see how far I can get shows that it's just, you know, and we're still going with different types of fruit, so. Well, is definitely his the snake's ability to track you is definitely increasing. Paying attention to the turtle, the turtle has ah. So, if you get the snake to go over the um, broken heart, I think that fixes the... Um Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, exit is open. So it has quite a few levels of the fruit types. Oh, that was lucky. Ah, oh, broken heart. And then we go. I've got an extra one. Yep, yeah, the snake definitely heals the um, broken hearts. Mm -hmm. Turn around. Come on, Saint. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, see, look, he's getting smarter. <laughs> well, it's actually not a bad game. Um, this one would have, uh, yeah, been a popular one. I'm just going to try arcade level. I just want to see how hard it is. But I won't play a full game unless I die quickly. Because we used a bit of video. Well, it's quite generous in the thing. Oh, I see. Look. Two snakes. A green one and a grey one. Ow. Okay, I don't know what that means. Oh, bees. Ah! So there we go, there are extra features in uh, the harder levels. So you obviously have to, um, you've only got a certain amount of time. That, but that is a much more impressive game than some of the others. A bit more playability, something that you can have a bit of fun with, um, and a good example of a good special video about game for the back of the day. They're all very original in concept, um, which is refreshing. So you're not going to see these games on other systems. Now, a good friend of mine, Klaus, uh, actually converted this across to the Coleco Vision. So. Um, he did a pretty good job with that as well. Alright, I'm Electric Adventures. Thanks to all my subscribers. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.